Welcome back to Obscure Coaster in 60 Seconds, episode 31. Let's go. Here's today's question. What is the most intense coaster ever built? I-305, Tower of Terror, Moonsault Scramble. All of these are great guesses and all pull somewhere in the neighborhood of five to six and a half Gs. What if I told you that on Coney Island in the 1890s, there stood a coaster that pulled double the G-force of these coasters at 12 Gs. Meet Flip Flap Railway at Paul Boynton Sea Lion Park. Opening in 1895, this coaster, designed by Lena Beecher, would first be constructed in Toledo, Ohio in 1888 and tested with sandbags and then monkeys before being moved to Coney Island. The reason for this insanely high g-force that the flip-flap railway pulled is because the ride featured no up-stop wheels or restraints, so the ride had to rely on centrifugal force to keep riders and the ride vehicles from physically falling out of the ride. Because of the g-force and perfectly circular loop, many riders would end up getting whiplash from the ride. In conclusion, it's insane this ride actually existed, and even though it's gone, its legacy will forever be remembered as one of the pioneers of roller coaster inversions. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to request a coaster to be covered in a future video, please comment down below. See you guys next time. Bye!